good morning students today i'll tell you how to download this key software and how to install in your laptop okay uh, let me go ahead so now just type here key it51 download okay so you have key download here get into it and then go ahead with download here again okay this uh, file accept all these cookies so go ahead with the download or the product download okay so in the product download we need download we need this 8051 microcontroller software that is keel 8051 microcontroller software so go ahead with the download okay so if you go ahead with this you will be getting like this so before which i have already given the username and password if it has for your username and password you can create a new username password and you can download this file and you can download this exe file and i have downloaded it is there in the downloads okay so c51 v960a so click on it click on the exe file and do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device yes go ahead with next agree to the license it will be there in c colon in the folder keel underscore version 5 so if you want to save it somewhere else you can even save it i am doing it in the c drive itself so i am giving it here my name my last name my company name and my mail id and then go ahead with next and start to install once it is done it will show finish finish it off okay and then I will go ahead here sorry I'll have too many tabs that is being opened and let me search here keel yeah open it here keel vision 5 Okay. So let me open a new project file. I don't know the previous one. I don't want the previous one which was already there. So let me go with the new Microsoft Vision project. Okay. In C51, let me give my name itself for the project. Okay. Save. And now I need to save search for the IC Atmel IC. Okay, I think Atmel is there. Yeah. So otherwise I can even see search at eighty eight nine C five one E D two this is the chip we'll be using in our lab okay click ok it will ask for copy startup.a51 click s yes. so now your target file is created now you are you whatever program that you are doing that will be added to this project file and then you will simulate it okay so file go ahead with new save this name it as uh, experiment 6 
which is nothing but timer we are going to do see now in the left side there is a target file you have a source group come here right click add existing files to source group what is that file that you have you never saved it as a asm so open that folder okay again uh, save as give save as because we are going to do program in asm experiment 6 underscore timer dot asm okay either you can give even dot c51 so now add that file here add existing files to source group click for asm file this here add that now you have added the file that where you will be writing the code into the project now it is done you can write the code here and simulate it before doing the timer program i'll just tell you with a how to simulate a small program so let me move a data move a comma hash 60 h come again move a comma t so this is one code okay first i'm moving 60 h to a and then from a i'm going to move this to b okay i have done this save it press control s translate build rebuild see there is no error ignore the warnings then debug press your d symbol automatically a register window will is, is here you are appearing if you want a line by line execution you need to press here step f11 okay you can even press f11 so first line c a is moved to 60 the second line b is also moved to 60 okay you can go in this way otherwise press your debug again if you want to have a total run press your debug press okay this is your run run otherwise the shortcut is f5 run and check see here a is 60 b is 60 the stack pointer default value is 07 okay thank you